Hi, Lou Mae Fredini, Aces Home Expert. And if you're gonna be painting a wall, chances are you don't want that color on the ceiling. So how do you cut it in to get that crisp, clean line? I'm gonna show you how it's done. To keep your wall paint from bleeding onto the ceiling, you have a couple of choices. The first is to use a tool called a paint shield. You place that in the corner between the wall and the ceiling, and then you carefully use a brush with the paint to kind of glide along the edge of the blade, moving it as you work your way across the wall. It's a good idea to have a damp rag ready, and after a couple of applications of the paint, pull the blade away and wipe any excess paint off of the blade as you continue. You can use painter's tape, apply the paint, and then use a brush to cut in a good two to four inches of paint around the area that you're gonna be cutting in. That way, when you come back over the roller, you don't have to get so close and you'll get professional looking results. Good quality tools do matter. This is an acrylic trim brush designed for latex paints. It holds a good amount of paint and gives you great control when applying the paint to the wall. A little trick of the trade when it comes to cutting in at the ceiling is you start applying the paint on the wall a little bit lower to allow the brush to flow and then work your way up to the corner so that you avoid the chance of any drips or runs in the paint. And that's it. Now, if you need more advice and tips, please go to our YouTube channel where you'll find more videos on painting. And you can always go to your local Ace Hardware store because Ace is the helpful place.